loving the weather mm -hmm. almost as, as much as uh, I love texting, video chatting, and using <laughs> social media. But uh, here's the deal are they affecting our relationships? Uh huh. Relationship expert Nancy Pena says they are not just long distance relationships, but couples who are uh, together, you know, in proximity, yes. too. And so, how yes. is this heavy reliance on technology affecting us? It's affecting us positively and negatively because mm -hmm. a lot of times we end up posting things all throughout the day and we have nothing to talk about when <laughs> we're actually in person. So the idea is mm -hmm. balance and also to use these technologies in a way that you are not, you're communicating well with each other so you're not having serious conversations like if you're texting something that really needs to be talked about in person mm -hmm. because a lot gets lost in communication you can't gauge how they're feeling you can't see into their eyes you can't touch the person mm -hmm. when you're talking about something serious over a text message can relationships can this be the demise to relationships especially especially those long distance relationships oftentimes you'll you'll hear the partner say well with all the technology we'll see each other every day right and that works to an extent if you know that this is a temporary stage in your relationship. It can really enhance your relationship and it can make you more intimate. For example, a lot of times people were geographically un undesirable because one person lived inside the loop and the other person lived in Katy. Mm. But now you can have a relationship where in separate countries. But I think it's so important that you remember that this is a stage. This isn't the permanent part of your relationship. Mm -hmm. And it, I think it's important that you mention not to talk about really serious, heavy subjects. Yes. A lot of things are lost in translation in a text message. I mean, I mistranslate things all the time, and I go, it's yeah. a that was that's rude. Oh, absolutely, <laughs> yeah. absolutely. And, and then feelings get hurt, mm -hmm. and then it just snowballs from there. And sometimes couples are just in such a early stage in their relationship, they can't get back, mm -hmm. you know, to a better stage in their relationship. Mm -hmm. So what should couples do if they're faced with this? You know, maybe he's going off, mm -hmm. um, you know, overseas, maybe she's got to go work abroad. I think the couple needs to sit down and take a realistic look at their relationship and make sure that this is just a temporary stage in their relationship. And if it's not, then they need to reevaluate. But they also make sure that they use technology sparingly, but also effectively, that it's a tool. It is not the driving force of their relationship. Mm -hmm. All right, Nancy Pena, as always, great, wonderful information. We could talk all morning about yes, this. Yes, we could. Yeah, unfortunately, <laughs> though, we got to check in with our Twitter followers yeah. and our Facebook.